In lesson three of second grade, you're continuing to work on mental math strategies. So lesson one, you did mental math strategies using number bonds and fact families, and we talked about the open number line as a big strategy that you'll use throughout second grade. In lesson three, you're using the make a 10 strategy, but in the book it introduces you to another strategy, which is the ladder model. And this is kind of a visual to kind of help you think through the make a 10 strategy. So I wanted to walk you through that today. This make a 10 strategy with the ladder model is not much different than the open number line, but instead of being horizontal, the ladder model is vertical. So think about it the same way we did with the open number line. And in this problem, we're looking at eight plus six. So there's our problem, eight plus six, we're starting at eight. And you can also kind of think about it about counting on. So I'm gonna count on, but instead of counting on all six, because we're trying to do this in our head, I'm gonna jump from eight to 10, because that's a friendly number. And again, the making a 10 strategy is what we're doing mentally. So I'm gonna jump from eight to 10, and I know that that was two spaces, all right? Thinking again about our open number line, I jumped up two, all right, from eight to 10. And then I've jumped two, but I wanna jump a total of six. So I need to jump four more. So I can say 10 plus four more, which is what I'm showing you here. I'm jumping four and 10 plus four more is 14. And so my total, Eight plus six is 14, because I jumped from eight to 10, and then 10 to 14 for a total of six jumps, all right? So again, not much different than the open number line, but it's using it vertically in the form of a ladder. Now, these blank spaces over here that they give you in the book might be a little confusing, so don't really worry about those as much. It might be better just to kind of make your own number sentence, all right? But let's look at the other example from the book. All right, this one is subtraction. So we're starting at 14 and we're taking away six. Well, again, we're trying to make a 10. Again, this is in our mind. So I know that I can just take away that four and that'll get me to 10. So in the diagram, it's showing you 14 and I'm jumping backwards four. So I'm taking away the four. If we think about our place value, we're taking away the ones in order to get to the 10. So I take away the four and I jump back four to get to 10. But then I have to jump a total of six. I've only jumped four, I gotta jump two more to get to six. So I have to take away two more. And that would take me from 10. If I jump two more, it takes me down to eight. So 14 minus six is eight. Again, this is a mental strategy. Not something that we all have to do. I personally like the open number line a little bit better, but this is a different way to show it to you, all right? So again, in our mind, we're trying to subtract or add and we're gonna jump to the next 10. So here in this one, I jumped from 14, I jumped down to 10. Again, it's taking our place value understanding and just taking away the ones to get to the 10 and then taking away a few more ones until we get down to our answer.